What's going on, everybody? It's the it's Brand Martin for guys once again, and this time I'm going to go over the 2015 NFL Week Four scoring recap from last week. First, we got the Baltimore Ravens taking on the Steelers, in which the Ravens won finally over. The Steelers with the score twenty three to twenty. And the next game, they were at London, England for the Indiana National Series, that the New York Jets were taking on the the Miami Dolphins. And that the New York Jets won over the Dolphins twenty seven to fourteen. Next one, we got the Jacksonville Jaguars taking on the Indianapolis Colts, and then the Colts. Win it in overtime with the score of 16 to 13. And we got the New York Giants taking on the Buffalo Bills. And that the New York Giants won over the Bills with the score of 24 to 10. Next one, we got the, the Carolina Panthers taking on the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And the and then the Panthers win this one to the score thirty seven twenty three, still a perfect record for the Carolina Panthers, going up to four and zero. We got the Philadelphia Eagles taking on the the Washington Redskins, and then the Redskins won this one with a score. Of twenty three to twenty, close game. Next one we got the Oakland Raiders taking on the Chicago Bears, and which is this is a close one. The Bears pulled it off with the score twenty to the twenty, and to give him the first win of the season, finally. And we get next one. We got the Houston Texans taking on the Atlanta Falcons. The Atlanta Falcons destroyed the Houston Texans with a score of forty-eight to twenty-one. Still a perfect record for the Atlanta Falcons. Next one, we got the the Kansas City Chiefs taking on the Cincinnati Bengals. In which the Cincinnati Bengals won over the Chiefs with a score of thirty six to twenty one, still keeping their for keeping their winning streak going for the for the Cincinnati Bengals. Next one we got the the Cleveland Browns, not the Cleveland Show. We're talking about the NFL team, the Cleveland Browns, taking on. The San Diego Chargers. San Diego Super Chargers. Okay. And which, it was a close one. And the Chargers pulled it off with the win over the Browns. With a score of 30 to 27. Next game, we got the Green Bay Packers. Taking on the San Francisco 49ers. In which the Packers won over the 49ers with the score of 17-3. And the 49ers are on to a three-game losing streak. And the Packers keep on winning with the four-game winning streak. Still undefeated right now. And we got the St. Louis Rams taking on the Arizona Cardinals. And the Rams... Broke the Arizona Cardinals going to 4 0, and that didn't work. So the Rams win this one with a score of 24 to 22. Next one, we got the Minnesota Vikings taking on the Denver Broncos, in which it, in which. In which Peyton Manning got two interceptions in the game. And that at the end of the game, they fumbled it, Broncos recovered it, and the Broncos pulled it off with a score of 23-20. 
Okay. Next game, we got the Dallas Cowboys taking on the, the New Orleans Saints. And which they win in overtime with the 80 yard pass. 80 yard. And pass it with the 80 yard. 80 yard touchdown overtime win over the Dallas Cowboys to pick up their first win of the season with the score of 26 to 20. And then the last one for. For last night's Monday Night Football, the Detroit Lions were taken on the Seattle Seahawks. In which the Lions were going to get a first win of the season, but then the Seahawks fumbled it, and then the Seahawks pulled this off with the score 13 to 10. And the, now the Lions are up now on a four game losing streak. And then the and and on a bye for last week it was the Tennessee Titans and the New England Patriots. And week five is coming, pretty coming tomorrow. In my predictions, yeah. And thank you guys for watching for this video. And if you like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And. And, and, please like this video, maybe leave a little comment, and point down with my finger, hit the button called subscribe please, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day everybody, have a great Tuesday.